Hey, what's happening everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to use a cutout tool or a drywall cutout tool as they're known. As you can see here, it basically cuts drywall. It does it much, much easier than using a box cutter um, with a razor blade on it. This thing is great. It doesn't create too much dust. There is some, but not too much considering what it can do for you. Um, you can set the depth setting on it for whatever depth you want depending on the size drywall you're using You can see right here. I'm gonna freehand around um, one of these ceiling fan uh, outlets here and Just uh, show you how it works and you can see right here. It just works like butter so uh, the blades last, uh, or the bits, they last a fairly long time. Um, I've also cut plywood, uh, plywood. I've also cut plywood with it, and sometimes um, it can get a little hot doing that. Um, not really great for that kind of stuff, but if you're in a bind, it worked great. Uh, this uh, osculating tool I was using there, I used to use that to cut drywall, and those will work, but uh, this tool is much better for that. So here I'm just going to show you cutting another outlet out here and just show you again how it works. Uh, the one I have is a Ryobi. They have all kinds of brands of course, but Ryobi tools have been great to me. I've not had any real issues with them to be honest. So you can see right here, boom, 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 done. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please consider doing so. I'm going to keep uh, posting videos like this and just keep everybody up to speed with what's going on we got a lot of things happening on the homestead here but there you go you can see here uh, I'm gonna fit it over like a glove over and out 